Hello and welcome to the session friends. My name is Yogesh Kumar. In this session, we are going to discuss performing file system repair on KVM disk images or uh, you can say QEMU images. So friends, uh, I have uh, documented problem setup and solution. So in problem, we are getting these errors when we are booting our KVM guest machine. They are saying metadata corruption on uh, XFS file system and recommendation is unmount and run XFS repair. As these machines are my KVM machines, I am not able to land uh, to a shell. So what I am going to do, I am going to run FSCK from the KVM master server or you can say KVM host, the server which is hosting these KVM virtual machines. Little bit about my setup. Virtual machine is KVM box 2. It's disk image or you can say QEMU images slash KVM store slash KVM box 2 dot IMG. And the KVM guest file system is XFS. As you can see from error, it's XFS. So I have just documented here again. What's the solution? First, we need to stop the guest VM. We can simply stop it using voice shutdown and the domain name or your KVM virtual machine name. Then we have to make sure we have got uh, libguestfs tools installed because this is the package which we are going to use for uh, repairing the file system. Then uh, we are going to use utility guestfish. This guestfish utility is delivered by libguestfs-tools package. Minus A is for the disk like we are saying this is our disk on which we are going to run FSCQ or do the operations. A run mean we are just starting the tool. List file system mean we are listing what the file system available on machine. And FSCK followed by file system type, then the device, then quit and start the VM. So let's do this session practically, friends. Okay, let me show you my machine config. This is my KVM host. Okay, I got two VMs, KVM box one and two, both are running, but this is console of KVM two. If you see here, it is throwing many errors like FS, XFS file system corruption happened and suggested action is to repair the file system, unmount and repair. But I'm not able to land uh, to a shell to perform the repairing. One way I can uh, boot from uh, CD-ROM, but that's a virtual system. I don't have much time to fix by booting into rescue mode or mounting, booting from CD, then mounting it. I don't want to spend much time. So what's the easy solution? From your KVM host, first shut down this guest VM, which got corrupted. It may take uh, one or two minutes come down and uh, that depends upon your uh, VM so let's wait for a couple of minutes okay if you see the machine is in down state now so next step we have to do we have to verify whether lib guest fs tools package is installed or not so simply run rpm Okay, friends, package is there. So now, next thing, run guestfish command. And minus A is to select the drive. I'm saying uh, select KVM store, KVM box 2.img. This is the image file. Okay, so now I'm on a file system shell of uh, guestfish utility. Run is to start the things. Okay, so this is done. Now let's list file systems. To list file systems on this particular image file, you have to run list file systems, press enter. If you see there are, this is the first partition, SDA1, it got XFS file system, then this is the root LV which got XFS, then there is the swap LV. So we can run FSCK, like uh, fsck then followed by file system type this is the file system type 
then device press enter okay it returned zero it mean everything came good let's do it on root volume now okay it's zero so that's good friends uh, it mean our file system repair is done even i can say it's not reported any file system corruption not show sure why on console it was not putting and uh, throwing xfs error that's fine we have uh, done our bit if uh, you got ext4 file system then you have to simply replace here with ext4 or ext3 whatever file system you got so this supports uh, most of the file system used in linux uh, one thing I want to tell you about this guest fish utility, you can use this utility to check uh, the contents within your uh, QEMU image. Let's say this is our image, right? It got uh, these file system. Let's mount this one. Mount this particular file system on slash and let's check its etcfs tab. If you see this is the etcfs tab of uh, inside this particular image. So that's a way using this uh, guest fish utility you can read the content of uh, image file or uh, let's check uh, some other file okay if you see this is dummy file so that's a way friends we can run fsck and we can uh, perform the operations let's unmount uh, this particular file system now so it's unmounted let's quit utility because we already done fsck now let's boot our uh, kvm virtual machine okay it started on other session i will monitor what's the progress so let me take console system is booting I hope it will not give file system error this time it's booting clean as of now services are starting so looks good as of now okay we got login prompt yeah, that's good friends uh, we got uh, our system booted file systems are mounted and this time no file system error so this is the way you can uh, perform file system repairing from uh, your KVM host on QEMU image file. It is not successful every time friends. Uh, your, if data corruption is heavy then uh, this utility may fail. Then you have to restore it from your backups. Means you have to restore your uh, image file from the backups. But again uh, I found this utility works most of the times. So thanks for watching this video friends if you have any query any suggestion or you want uh, some more information you can leave a comment on my youtube channel so thank you again for watching this video thanks bye bye